has Ray Davis. And Ray Davis picking up right where he left off last week. And Davis, the leading rusher in the SEC, 119 yards per game. Deep throw, single coverage. Barry on Brown, Kudzilis Rams. Plenty of time for Leary. And the catch by Tavion Robinson among active FBS players. Davis the other way. First down across midfield. Leary given all kinds of time trying to throw it to Davis on a wheel route. And it's out of bounds about every time. Again, plenty of time for Leary as a man wide open, and it's over the head of Tavion Robinson. Carson Beck four for four. And comes out firing again. Still perfect. First down. Ra Ra Thomas the catch for a 12 yard. Really good down the field. Covered by Maxwell Hairston. Here's the first catch for Brock Bowers. The nation's leading tight end with 30 catch down with under three minutes to go. At Auburn last week. Beck over the middle. Oscar Delp. The number. And job one tonight is stopping him. They didn't that time. Here he comes again, a tight end screen. Good for 11 more. Mike Bobo. Jared Zirkel kicks off. And it is mishandled by Anthony Brown Stevens. And he goes out of the back of the end zone. And a classic that was that game never disappoints Ray Davis squirts up the middle for three here's Molly McGrath Sean on that last drive quarterback Devin Leary was off the second and seven looking deep again another wide open receiver caught this time by Dane Key and into Georgia territory again from the 36 of Georgia and another quality gain on first down. It's Barry on Brown, the sophomore from Nashville. There is a flag. It's Eli Cox at center. Burton's playing right guard. Davis driven back by Chaz Chambliss. And another penalty. Looked like it was the right tackle, Jeremy Flax. Here comes pressure. Leary given time, and it's too high for Dane Key. A fired up Kamari Lassiter had Brother of Jordan Berry, who's punted in the NFL. Kai Muse let it bounce, and Kentucky's going to down it near the one yard line. Carson Beck has completed his first 11. Here's Dylan Bell around the corner. And knocked out of bounds at the 32 yard. It's Edwards looking for some space. And he has the first down taken down by De'Eric Jackson, the senior linebacker for Georgia. 14 tonight. Beck, 11 out of 11. Beck fires and it's incomplete. Broken up by Andrew Phillips. They're on offense for Georgia. Carson Beck. Now 12 for 12. Short completion of Ra Ra Thomas. A moment ago, Molly with Coach Dukes. Coach Carson Beck is 11 for. Win for Kentucky against Georgia was in 2009. They've lost 13 straight. And that pass batted out of the air by Deion Walker. Kentucky players think it's a. And is the running back. He's been banged up here in the early season. He scoots ahead for seven. He was their third leading rusher last year. Darnell Washington, great number two tight end alongside Bowers, drafted in the third round. Dominic Lovett. And they had a very important receiver. They've been moving the ball consistently. They've just dug themselves a huge hole, and that one dropped. That's been another problem. It hasn't all been on Leary. The low completion percentage. Tavion Rock. Davis juggled the ball for a moment after taking the handoff. Jamon Dumas Johnson made the tackle, a gain of two. Georgia brings pressure. Davis stays in to help pick it up. That ball is incomplete. Intended for Barry on Brown, Dalen Everett. And they move. 
Again at the right end of the line. It might have been flax for the second time. Down Georgia crowding the line. Larry on target. And Tavion Robinson the first down. They'll mark him just inside the 20. Well. A throw back. Another good call. It's Josh Caddis. One of their tight ends up the play calling and again an open receiver Tavion Robinson in the flat you know that should be Davis lots of running room and a first down inside the five four and three touchdowns little squib kick by Kentucky and handled on a fair catch. Here's Matt Berry. Gentlemen, allow me to present you. Downs in three possessions. Back at the Kentucky 21 to the end zone and incomplete for Ra Ra Thomas with Andrew Phillips in coverage. Edwards, nifty move and some shaky tackling. Passed his career high of 338 a couple of weeks ago against UAB. Looking for his fourth touchdown pass of the half. Oh my goodness, take Bauer's scholarship away. <laughs> he couldn't last year. Beck is the holder. And that 36 yarder is good. So Woodring is 7 out of 10 now in field goals in his freshman season. Leary to the sideline and good run after the catch by Dane Key 13 yard gain they continue to move the ball 69 and 9 out of 20 last week in the win against Florida but they had the big rushing day up for grabs and it should have been intercepted by Kamari Lassiter he had inside position on Dane Key nation nearly had another Leary off target he had a man curling open, Anthony Brown Stevens, the true freshman from Springfield, Ohio. Play clock at two. They just did get it off, and he's under the rest and buried. Back at the 25. Javon Dumas Johnson. Line as this possession begins for Georgia. With Edwards running. Off left guard and powering his way for a first down and more. Here's Molly. Peloton bike or something, you know what I mean? Cedric Van Pran, the center, is the injured player. He's a stalwart. 36 consecutive starts, most on the Georgia team. Not in any hurry. Takes the clock all the way down. A low snap and a touchdown. Kendall Milton. It's 30 to 7. Yeah. First rushing touchdown of the game. Second of the season for Milton. Woodring, the extra point is good. Georgia has scored. Holder. That looked like the form of a young man who was the number one high school kicker in the country last year. That first 30 minutes. We start with Leary under center and try to establish the run with Ray Davis. Five yard gain for eight yards per carry coming in. Of course, when you run for 280 in a game, you're going to have some impressive averages. Chaz Chambliss, good coverage on the tight end, Josh Cannis. Even with a passive rush, they still almost got to Leary. There is a flag down, a couple, in fact, in the offensive backfield is the pass. Wilson buried the putter. Mackay Muse got hit hard at the 39 yard line by Trevin. On defense under Stoops, but they're getting gashed tonight, and that continues. Milton straight ahead. Good news for Georgia. Cedric Van Pran is back in at center. Ratledge the guards. They didn't have a great day at Auburn. On target, first down. Ra Ra Thomas the catch. 
you know, this is three straight games with 300 yards passing for Beck, and he did it in the half tonight. Dejan Edwards, a short gain out of bounds inside the 40. You have to go back 10 years for the last time. And this net last one should be very one. easy. Yeah. Here's Dylan Bell. A yard short of the first down at the Kentucky 34. Greg McElroy <laughs> threw for. Th they fake the run on third down and one. Receivers open everywhere. Flag down to the secondary. Marcus Rosamy. Just a three man rush for Kentucky into traffic and with some running room along the near sideline. And chopped down by Beck. Or he's already turned two for a touchdown this year. And that one brought back 47. Give a little life to the Wildcats. Ray Davis for two. Quarterback was another reason why he wanted to come back to Kentucky. Wide open Davis. First down inside the 10. Touchdown, Kentucky. Davis, the running back on the right hip O'Leary. They direct snap it to Davis. Trying to surge toward the end zone. He got stacked up well short. They kick it down into the wind. Caught on the run by Muse. Makai Muse. Came as a walk-on. He's been a dynamic kick. The only tight end in the top ten in the voting since 1977. Ken McAfee. He's supposed to go to the best player in college football. A lot of great players, but he merits significant. Here's Ray Davis. This is the third straight year. Kentucky off to a great start. Six four of those games more than likely, depending on how things shake out. Leary's pass, hard to tell if that was tipped. That's been a problem, batted balls. 69 straight sellouts, and they love it. Jamon Dumas Johnson with his second sack. Academy for Biff Pogey. When he started there, now the coach at Charlotte. In his first year as a head coach in college, swearing in someone that took place at the spring game. They call it getting <laughs> collared. Really? You're officially uh, the new and the latest in the long line of great Uggas, one of the great mascots. And this. Under a minute and a half to go in the third quarter. Deep ball and incomplete. Rosemi Jackson ain't one on one. On third down and nine, Beck, quick throw, caught. Beautiful throw, threw it in the perfect place for Ron Ron Thomas. Down. Powers is wide open. Touchdown. Powers from an athletic family. His parents were athletes at Utah State. His sister, a collegiate athlete. Ray Davis weaves his way ahead for about seven. Just enough to help the passing game. Ray Davis, the ball carrier on second and two as the fourth quarter begins. And he got three. Devin Leary batted down. Well played. Xavier Sorry. And Stoops, the eighth longest tenured coach in his current position in the country. Ray Davis, the ball carrier. Obviously, Mark Stewart. They were 10 and 3 in both 2018 and 2021. And that one's dropped by Tavion Robinson. It'll be fourth down and seventh time. Muse signaling enthusiastically for the fair catch, and he made it while backpedaling at the 21. UT Martin, Ball State, UAB, and now Kentucky. Dylan Bell. With a short game. Davin Rayner made the six total yards of offense. They had some good moments in the first half. Demi Sumo Karnbe, the ball carrier. Molly? Sean. 1996 when at Auburn when Ugger went. Tried to lunge? Yeah, lunge at one of the Auburn players. Oh, I've, I've seen that picture a million times. You did that game? I did that game uh, for CBS. Mm -hmm. 
and on, on uh, I believe on YouTube. So people are watching the game with Coach Donovan and getting his insights. Jalen Walker in on the sack. Dominant. And this game getting good. Jawar Jordan for Louisville to the outside, beating Notre Dame 17-13. Brock Vandegriff on for his second series, hands it off to Cash Jones, the former walk-on. He got chopped down shy of the 30 by Zion. Before he had his boo-boo on his knee, but now here's Vandegriff taking off and running out near midfield. Significantly with his accuracy as well. Andrew Paul is in at running back number three. That's off the hands of Lawson Lucky. And they think is going to be a tremendous tight end. True fresh in any game was in the SEC championship game December of 2021 to Alabama. So they started the winning streak. That's Andrew Paul, the redshirt freshman from Dallas. They sang Tennessee from back in the late 30s. We got some intel on that team from our statistician Mike Swanson who worked some of those balls <laughs> games in the late 30s. The, uh, the 588 yards of total offense. Savon Clark, the ball carrier. Tyrese Fear really sure how to feel about them at the moment. Vandergriff wants Lucky to block for him. He got shot down right at the for Georgia to 11 for Kentucky. First and goal, and Paul dragged down for no gain. The premier program in college football without a doubt. Vandegrift, juggling attempt by Anthony Evans the third. Looks like they're gonna give him the catch with tie one against Charleston Southern. All kinds of time, and he nearly threw an interception. Davin Rayner going for it from the eight. Vandergriff's four out of six for 39 since coming in for Beck. Andrew Paul to the pylon.